And here we are back uh, from that early morning training. This is a Saturday, and it's only one day before the race. Uh, now it's uh, time for junior races, so we had to go really early on the course and we did only one last lap just to be sure that we uh, got uh, everything on our mind and remember every every single part of the course and uh, that's mostly it about our trainings just before the race and uh, now here we are after one coffee just waiting uh, other stuff to come back and uh, now just thinking a little bit about the race with Jovana Cnogorac, of course you know who she is, we don't need to introduce her, so you asked some of uh, our talks, just how we feel before the race and what we think about, so if you want to start first or if you want me just to say something about the course. Yeah, of course I can say first. Hi everyone, uh, first. Um, this is the this is the new course, and uh, we never raced on this uh, course in Italy here. And it's a little bit different than uh, the other ones when you already know the course and you come and you know already the lines and you just go and uh, do a normal training. But here we we needed to do some uh, days first to check the course, and it's a little bit uh, difficult some parts. But of course, when you have guys with you, it's uh, easier, right? So it was a little bit surprised to see that they actually made uh, two sections easier than they were before. There was uh, one uh, rocky section with one huge rock that uh, we actually did ride before, but now it's even easier. But on some parts uh, before that is now not so easy because as many people ride on course every day, it just get, uh, you know, as much... Uh, slippery more than it was before because as Johanna said it's new course so it's not so stiff ground as uh, it would be normally and also one more part uh, where actually many people crashed unfortunately that was one drop just before the finish now they cut it on half so now it's much easier what do you think about those parts you had some little bit problems with that rock yeah it's uh when we came here it was a little bit difficult for me because i never saw the course right and uh the just the part uh, with the stone it looks uh it looks okay, but when you see every day uh, five or s maybe to ten riders crashing there and uh, ambulance car uh, uh, are coming and going all, all day, you, you feel like, okay, I'm not, I don't know if I want to do it. So, yeah, it's, uh, it looks easy, but uh, I guess on the race when you come uh, with the full speed and uh, very tired, uh, I'm not sure if you will, uh, if you will be 100% uh, on, that, on that part. Yeah, actually, I did ride it uh, maybe second day and then I tried to come, as Joanna said, like in race mood, so very tired and then I crashed and then the whole day I couldn't ride it and I had that limit in my mind, even it was all the same. But now I think it's going to be a little bit easier as they made that slope after those rocks pretty uh, easy without big angles. So now the biggest part is that uh, rocks before that huge stone. But uh, we will see about that actually many things can happen and uh, if the race is full on if someone crashes uh, before you, that changes lots of stuff. And what about that uh, drop? Did you ride it today? Yes, I, ro I rode it uh, yesterday with uh, Edward and today also. And uh, it's uh, it's just a normal it's just a normal drop where you just uh, drop your bike and uh, you just go and you don't need a big speed because it's uh, you come uh, from the from the downhill where it's. Uh, pretty steep and you already have the speed and then you jump and you drop it on the same uh, on the same angle of the of the downhill so you have nothing to do there so that's really good uh, examination with uh, Jonas Snogorac I think you will appreciate that our races are tomorrow mine is 9 30 and yours 12 so we hope for the best for our juniors which are racing right now and also 
hope that you are going to cheer us tomorrow so thanks for watching and see you after the race Thank you.